The Inspector General of Police spent close to three hours before Parliament's appointments committee defending his record and that of the force he leads. The police chief, who has already served three terms, was questioned a number of issues ranging from police's human rights record to the alleged militarization of the force. But when he did emerge, Kaihura was a confident man with eyes set on improving the welfare of the police, particularly housing. In this print in the traffic police, which the president talked about, you remember? Eh? Yes. We, we have to must acknowledge it. Uh, we must, at the same time, though, solve the problem of accommodation. Kaihura denied accusations leveled against him of being partisan and sectarian while executing his duties. Many members of the opposition are my friends. Is in my, is in my shirt blue. If, if we are talking about, you see, don't vulgarize things. For me, let me tell you, I serve people without discrimination. I love Ugandans. As he gets the parliamentary nod, Kaihura will now serve a fourth term as IGP. Separately, Kaihura told journalists that the police had made progress in its investigations into the death of city tycoon area Sebunyabugembe, popularly known as Kasiwukira. We are, we are doing well. I don't want to prejudice the, the investigation. We have very useful lines of, uh, lines of investigation and uh, we, at an appropriate time we shall give you an update. Kasi Okira, a man respected for having pioneered the promotion of local music, was killed in a suspected hit and run accident on the 17th of October as he went about his early morning jog near his residence in Muyenga. Maurice Chol, NTV.